I'm standing here today in the middle of the Occupy the London Stock Exchange protest in the centre of the City of London. I'm here with several thousand other people peacefully protesting. We can't at the moment leave because we're being casual for reasons I know it. Uh, and as you can hear, there's uh, plenty of police helicopters overhead. But we're here for a very important reason and if we, uh, we, we have a message to get across. A message that's being spread around the world as part of this worldwide movement that the economic system is simply catering to a very small number of people and the rest of the people are simply serving their interests. Now, to take one example of that, that I'm particularly concerned with and the Green Party is particularly concerned about, is the Corporation of the City of London. We're in the centre of its one square mile now and it is not democratically controlled, it's actually controlled by the financial industries and it has special uh, access. It can ask to see the Prime Minister, it can even ask to see the Queen any time that it wants to. And it also has representative on the floor of the House of Commons lobbying MPs. It also holds a huge fund of money that's been built up by the people of the City of London over the centuries uh, that should be being used for the people of the City of London but is now being used to support the financial industries. Now, we've got a lot to do that we need to change in our economic system, both here in Britain and around the world. But it's things like examples like this where we need to start to really change the structures of our society so that we can move forward to an economically and environmentally sustainable future.